Mr. Christian, your dear deceased dead uncle has requested all three of you, Apollonia, Brenda, Susan, be present at the reading of his will. He was a generous man of noble soul, a mellifluous provider to those in need. His school for reformed young ladies is world famous for its adoption of progressive ideas within a previously antiquated milieu. I trust you will respect his last wishes and accept them with the same spirit in which they were bequeathed. <clears throat> if you're ready, Susan. Mr. Christian. <sighs> Being of sound mind and body, I, Rupert Christian, late of the Christian School for Young Ladies and others, hereby confirm that this is indeed my last will and testament. To Edith Williams, my long and faithful personal lawyer, I leave my entire estate of cars, houses, stocks and bonds, furs, jewelry, and vineyards in the south of France, plus the animals, of course. To Apollonia, Susan and Brenda, three of my more stubborn students, I leave absolutely nothing. Tough duty, girls. It's time you learned the value of hard, honest work. No more sponging off of me. Out into the real world for you or starve. How do you like them apples? In case you're wondering, Apollonia, it's spelled W-O-R-K. <clears throat> yes, dear. A four-letter word you're probably not very accustomed to. <laughs> We have nothing to wear. Precisely. Temperature to your place while I'm still. 